Tonight only on 13, Metro Police have hope that social media can help them track down a burglar who targeted the home of a man with special needs. Investigators have posted pictures of the thief, and tonight his victim talked with our crime rate reporter Steve Jefferson about how you can make sure that this doesn't happen to anyone else. That break-in happened in the middle of the day. The victim lives here in Brookwood Apartments. The suspect had no idea the whole time the cameras were rolling. This is a snapshot of a burglar Metro Southeast District detectives hope you recognize. He's caught on camera after breaking into the apartment of Dustin Gilmore. And I decided to, to go in for half the day rather than, uh, you know, stay home. And uh, about the time I left around noon, uh, apparently someone broke in and vandalized my entire apartment. Dustin posted photos of his ransacked apartment. He also shared video on social media showing the suspect walking up to the apartment and eventually kicking in the door. You can also see him carrying out Dustin's belongings, like his television to a van parked outside. That's a little frustrating uh, because, you know, you, I work, work for all the stuff that I have in my apartment and didn't know that somebody can just come in and take it whenever they want. It's kind of uh, disheartening a little bit. Chances are the burglar believes he made a clean getaway, but detectives have also posted his face pictures on the Franklin Township Facebook page, hoping someone knows exactly who he is. Here's another close-up look at the burglar, who Dustin doesn't want to see rip off anyone else. I, mean, I would just encourage him to contact the police and um, uh, if they have any idea of who it is and that way we can keep from other people going through similar similar situations that I went through this weekend. So, If you recognize a suspect, call Crime Stoppers. The telephone number is 317-262-TIPS. On the Crime Beat, I'm Steve Jefferson.